Inshallah, today, Inshallah, we are going to take unit 2E. 2E. So please open the student book, page 30. And let's, let's start, okay? I want all of you to answer this exercise alone. Then listen and check your answers. Here we have a dialogue between A and B. He said, hey, Steve. And he said something. Which one of them? Tell me about it. Guess what, like you. And he said, what? And A said, I got a new video game. And B said, really, that's great. And he said something else. What was it? Which one of them? And then he said, well, it's called Motors and it's a car racing game. It's full of action and I love it. And finally, he said something of these sentences. And he said, I want a new game too. So all of you answer, use a pencil and answer. Okay, and write today's date. Again, today is 14 slash 12. Now let's listen. 2E. Read and listen. A. Complete the dialogue below between two friends with the phrases A to C. Then listen and check your answers. Hey Steve, guess what? What? I got a new video game. Really? That's great. Tell me about it. Well, it's called Motors and it's a car racing game. It's full of action and I love it. Lucky you! I want a new video game too. Okay, now let's answer. Huh? Who know number one? Zena Ahmed Aysom? Yes, Miss. Yalla Zena, huh? What's number one? Guess what? Excellent. Guess what? Which is B. So all of you write B here. Thank you, Zena. Nadine? Nadine Ahmed Aysom? Yes. Which class are you in, Nadine? Which class are you in? 4E. Okay, Nadine. Huh. What's number two? Tell me. Excellent. Tell me. So which is letter A? Tell me about it. And what's number three? Uh, who knows? Hanin. Hanin Sameh. Hanin. Hanin. Yes, miss. Yeah, like, Hanin, what's number three? Lucky you. Lucky you, which is letter C. C. So here, again, thank you. Here we have a dialogue. And here you are giving information or you are speaking about details. So when you want to speak about details or if you want to give information to someone, you use these words. Tell me about it. Or guess what? Guess means think. Huh? What? What is it? What happens? And you can use lucky you. If uh, uh, there there was something very uh, happy or very pleasant happen to your friend, so you say lucky you. Let's go to exercise B. Huh? Who can answer? I got a new video game. Here you are giving news or you are giving details. Giving details means giving information or description. You describe your, uh, your point, okay? So if I say I got a new game, so it's giving news or giving details. Malak Haysam. Giving details. Are you sure? Giving details means to describe, to describe your point. Or describe what did you have. It's giving uh, you. Yes, I give you info uh, news. I give you news. So it's letter A. And Yamalak yeah, now, well, it's called motors and it's a car racing game. It's full of action and I love it. So all of giving these details. are giving details. Giving details means you describe giving. yes, excellent. You describe your game. You give me information about your game. But giving news means tell me only the title, what happened to you, and then you give me details about it. Okay, Malak, do you understand? Yeah. 
Okay, let's go to exercise C. Here, I want all, you, all of you to listen to the phrases in the tables and repeat them. I want all of you to repeat, okay? C. Listen to the phrases in the tables and repeat them. Giving good news. Guess what? Listen to this. Did I tell you about my new video game? So here, when I want to give news, when I want to give you news, I say, guess what? I start with guess what? If I want to tell my friend and news, okay? Listen to this. Did I tell you about my new video game? So again, I want all of you to listen and repeat, okay? I want to hear your voices. Listen and repeat. I am here. Start from here. Listen and repeat. Responding to good news. Really? Really? Congratulations. Congratulations. That's great. Amazing. That's great. Amazing. Oh, that's fantastic news. That's great. That's, that's really fantastic. Really, I'm really happy for you. Good for you. How wonderful, exciting. How wonderful, exciting. What wonderful news. What wonderful news. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. So when I hear good news, what did I say? Uh, I say, really? I say, congratulations. Or that's a great, that's amazing, and so on. So when I hear good news, I use these words. Okay? Let's go to the last part. If you want to, uh, to ask for details, you want to know more information, huh? what will you say? I want all of you to listen and repeat. Asking for details. Tell me about it. So, when, where, who, what did you? How was it? What kind of game is it? Were you excited, scared? So, if you want to ask about more details or more information, you will use these words. Tell me about it. So, when, where, who, what did you? How was it? What kind of game is it? Were you excited or scared? Okay. Let's go to exercise D. Now you will use this table. You will use this table and answer this exercise. Imagine a friend gave you the following news. What details would you like to know? You will think of two questions. For example, I went to the new amusement park. Amusement park, it's like dream park. Amusement park, it's like a dream, you know dream park? So when someone told you that he went to the new amusement park, uh, which question will you use? You will use this, you will use, you will choose one of these questions. All of you look at this table in your book. You will choose one of these questions. Hey, I went to the new amusement park. Who can give me a question about it? Hey. Jana Mohammed Salema? Jana Mohammed Salema? Jana, do you hear me? Yes, teacher. Yeah. I went to the new amusement bar. Can you give me a question? Jana, do you hear me, Jana? Yes. Can you answer this exercise? No. Okay, look with me, Jana. Yeah. Now you choose one of these questions. I told you that I went to the amusement bar. Choose any one of them. Uh, like, huh? Yalla, Jana, read. Where are you going? Jana, I can't hear you. Tell me about it. Yes, tell me about it. It's a question. And you have another question, huh? When, where? When did you? 
Now you uh, tell me the verb. When did you? Mm. When did you go? When? Yes. So all of these are questions if you want to ask for details, if you want to know more information. Do you understand now, Yajana? Yes. Okay, let's continue. So here you can write a question, use your pencils and write, everyone. So write, when did you go? And you can write, tell me about it. Tell me about it. Okay. Listen, listen to this. I met a famous person. Huh? Who can give me question about this sentence? Listen to this. I met a famous person. Fairuz. Fairuz. Yes. Give me a question. Listen to this. I met a famous person. Choose question from this list. Who was it? Who? What? Huh. Who was it? No, I said I met. How? I yes, it's okay. How was it? And how did you see him? Excellent, Fairuz. How? This is mean. How did you see him? So listen to this. I met a famous person. You can say how was it? And how did you meet him? Okay, who can give me another question? Who can give me another question? Hey, girls, where are you? Rancy? Rancy? Rancy, do you hear me? I'm with you. Okay, again, Rancy? I'm with you. Can you give me a more, uh, one more uh, question about this sentence? Yeah. Yes. Huh. Um, tell me about it. Yes, tell me about it. Excellent. Thank you. Uh, who else? Let's go to number three. Uh, guess what I won? Guess what I won? I won a competition. I won the race. I won the race. Huh. Who can give me question about this? Guess what? I won a competition. Hmm. Uh, who knows? Be sane. Be sane. Yeah. Yala, give me questions about this sentence. Guess what? I won a competition. How was it? Excellent, but you can choose new uh, new sentence, uh, new question, like here. What kind, uh. what kind of game? No, what it was, of, yes, excellent. Of, what kind of game is it? Excellent, because it was a competition. It was a game. So you can, which kind of game did you win? Excellent, Yabisen. What kind of game? So I can write here, what kind of game? And uh, who has uh, one more question? Haya Khalid? Haya Khalid? Haya Khalid? Haya Khalid, do you hear me? Jana Khalid. Jana Khalid. Where are you people? Jana. Jana Khalid. Miss. Yalla hi. Okay, hi Khalid. Guess what? I want a competition. Ask a question about this sentence. Hmm. Um. Uh, congratulations. Excellent. Congratulations. But here I'm not asking about information. I want you. I want to uh, ask information about this. Here you choose from this part, or here. When you hear a good news, you say congratulations. But I am asking about this part that you want uh, to know okay. more information. So, huh, which question will you use? Mm. Guess one. I want. Where, huh? Huh? Uh, when? When? Hmm. When did 
So in the past, two. yes, I have won. So when did you one. win uh, the competition? Excellent. When did you win the competition? Excellent. Did I tell you about my new mobile phone? Huh? Who can give me two questions about this sentence? Malak Amr. Malak Amr. Yes, miss. Yalla, Malak. Give me a question about this sentence. You are asking for details. So what will you say? Did I tell you about my new mobile phone? Huh? Yeah. Do you know? Do you know, Malak? Were you excited? Were you excited? Yes. Were you excited? Excellent. Were you excited? Excellent. Uh, who has another question? Who can give me another question? Hmm. Serene? Yes. Bansi? I have a question, yes. Okay, Bansi. Huh. Really? Yes, really? Yes. Yeah, it's a okay. question. And what else you want to say? Do you have another one? Uh, uh, you are speaking about guess what? I won a competition, you want to see? No, I tell about phone. Did I tell you about my new mobile phone? No, but here uh, uh, I, I didn't give you the information or I didn't give you the detail that you say really. Okay? Okay. So you will, ha you, will a you will ask another question. Did I tell you about my new mobile phone? Let's look at the, at the list and choose another question you want to see. Okay. Let's go together. Huh? When I, when I tell you that, did I tell you about my new mobile phone? So which, which sentence will you say? Huh? What, kind, what kind of game is it? What, what kind of phone? Ba? What kind of phone is it? Or I can say, even say, tell me about it. Okay, you can say, tell me about it. Okay? Okay. Huh, who can give me one more question? Who can give me one more question about did I tell you about my new mobile phone? Farida Khalid. Farida Khalid. Hey Farida, give me another question. Hey Farida. Farida, are you with me? Yes. Yes, go to the list and choose one of them. Did I tell you about my new mobile phone? Huh? Which one can you choose? Huh? Which one? Huh? You can say, uh, when did you get it? When did you get it? Or you can say where, from where did you buy it? Okay? Okay, Haya? What's, or uh, Farida? Do you hear me, Farida? Yes. Okay, do you understand? Yes. Okay. Okay, let's go to the exercise D. Exercise uh, the speaking exercise. Okay, here we will have two. We will choose two students and you will speak together. You will ask these questions. Imagine you have some good news to tell your friend, so you will choose a good news. Choose one of the situation from activity D. You can choose one of it, you can choose one of these news, or you can use from your mind. And answer student B's questions giving details. He will ask you, the other student will ask you another question. Question about the good news. And student B will listen to student A good news and respond to it. Like here. I went to new planetarium. Planetarium, it's like a museum. Planetarium is a museum, but special for the planets. Okay? 
a museum for the planets. And he, the other student, will say, really fantastic. When did you go? And he will give you details. I went yesterday with my cousin. It was very interesting. And uh, student A will say, what did you do there? And student B will say, well, we watched a 3D film about, and you can say whatever you want. And finally, he will say, how exciting. Okay, now let's choose two people uh, who want to say, uh, who can raise up your hand. Again, uh, are you with me? Let's uh, choose two people uh, who want to speak with me. Sandy, Sandy, do you hear me? Sandy. Okay, who else who want to speak? Uh, Lucky Amr. Lucky Amr. Yes, Yalla, Malak. So we have two Malak and Sandy. Hello. Yalla Malak start. Tell Sandy about good news. Okay. I went to the new planet museum. No, say say another thing. You can choose from this exercise. Or okay. you can say from your mind, Ya Malak. Okay. Yeah. I went to the new cinema. Yes, you went to the new cinema. Yalla Sandy? Huh? What will you say, Sandy? Sandy, look at this table, and you can choose one of them. Now, Malak said you, I went to a new cinema. Huh? You can see one of them. Choose one of them. Huh? Sandy, are you with me? Yes. Yalla, Sandy, choose one of them. You can say, huh? Really? Really? And ask her about it. Uh, ask her question about the it. cinema. Tell me about it. Excellent. Yalla, Mala, complete. We, there was a lot of popcorn and I, and there was 3D films. Excellent. And finally, uh, yes, Andy, you can say one of them. Choose one of them, yes, Andy. Hmm. That's, that's great. Excellent. Or lucky you. Or good for you. Thank you, Yasendi. Thank you, thank you, Malak. Uh, who else? Uh, who can say with me? I want for two people. Where are you, Navila? 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 Do you hear me, Navila? Navila? Yalla, Navila. And Maya Tori. Maya Tori, are you with me? Yes, Miss. Yalla, Navila. Tell Maya good news. Hmm. Navila, I can't hear you. Navila. Navila, I can't hear you. Hmm. Navila. Navila, do you hear me? Navila. Tab, let's choose Hala Muhammad Sabir. Hala Mahmoud Sabir. Hala Mahmoud Sabir. Hala Mahmoud Sabir. Jana Khalid. Jana Khalid. Jana Khalid. Jana. Lamar Muhammad Samir. Lamar Muhammad Samir. Do you? Yalla Lamar. Till Maya, are you with me, Maya? Maya. Yalla. Okay, Maya. Lamar, tell Maya about good news. Hmm. 
Tell her any good news. Uh, it's connected. Who? Maya? Yes, miss. Lamar, Lamar, are you with me? Do you understand me? Yeah. Tell me or tell Maya any good news. I go to to use my card yesterday. Okay. Hi, Maya. Maya. When uh, did you? Excellent. But first, you must choose one of them. That's really good for you and that's great. And then you will say this, okay? Tell me about it. Yes, yalla Maya. So my, tell me about it. Excellent. And then yalla ya. It is very beautiful and it is very good. Yes. Complete ya Maya. Ask her another question. Hmm. I tell you about my new video game. No, no, you can. Uh, Maya will tell you what did you do there. Hey, Maya. Maya, are you with me? Yes, miss. Yes, you can tell her. You can say to her, uh, "What did you do there?" Yes. What? Yalla, yeah. Lamar, answer. I, I eat popcorn and cotton candy. Okay, thank you. Okay, I want all of you to go to the next page. I want all of you to listen carefully. Listen carefully. Here you have read the email and answer the question. Email means a letter. A letter. You send it online. So this is email. Okay, listen carefully because I will ask you a question, okay? Speak and write. A. Read the email and answer the questions below. Dear Alison, how are things? I hope you're well. Guess what? Last week, my family and I went to Dublin. I was very excited because it was my first time on a plane. It went really fast during takeoff, but I wasn't scared at all. I loved it. I had a window seat so I could see the amazing view. I took pictures of the clouds, the snowy mountains, and even of a train. It looked like a toy. The flight lasted three hours and ten minutes, but I wasn't bored. The flight attendant brought us tasty snacks and there were even little screens so we could watch films. I can't wait to fly again. Right back soon, Julia. Okay, let's, uh, I will ask you some question. Okay, who can tell me who is writing the email? Who wrote this email? Huh. Who wrote this email? Fairuz? Julia. Excellent, Julia. And to whom did she write, Fairuz? To whom? She wrote it for uh, Alison. Alison. Excellent. She wrote to Alison. Excellent. And what, thank you, Fairuz. What first time experience did Julia have? Huh. What happened to her? So all of you write, Julia is sending the email to Alison. Write in a sticky note, huh? or in a piece of paper. Write in a sticky note on a piece of paper. Who is writing the email and who is she writing to? So Julia is sending the email to Alison. What first time experience did Julia have? Experience means something you do for the first time or something you, you do before, huh? Experience. What first time experience did Julia have? Who knows? Jana Abdurrahim. Jana Abdurrahim. Yes, Miss. Yale Jana. Huh? What first time experience did Julia have? On what? On plane. On plane. Yes, let's get a go again. It was my first time on a plane. 
so it was uh, the, her experience is the first time to be on a plane okay let's go to question three when did it happen Farida Ahmed Said Farida Ahmed Said when did it happen uh. hmm. when when was she first time on a plane when was her first time on a plane hmm. do you know your Farida let's no. go here let's go and read uh, guess what last week she said last week so it was her when when your Farida week last week who was with her huh? who knows who was was her Farida Khalid Farida. Yes, miss. who was with her yes. who was with her, her okay. family her family excellent how did she feel huh? who knows huh? how did she feel uh, who knows? Lujain Muhammad Farooq. Uh, how did she feel, Lujain? Lujain, do you know? Lujain? Excited. Excited. Let's see. Uh, excellent. I was very excited. So you can write only one sentence. She was excited. She was excited, right? One of them. Excellent, Yalujain. How long did the experience last? Hmm. Last means what was the time? Which time? Hmm. How about the time of the experience? Uh, how much time did it take? How much time did it take this experience to be on the plane? Uh, who knows? Nadine Ahmed Aysom? Yes. How, how long did the experience last? Three hours. Excellent. Excellent. Three hours and ten minutes. Three hours and ten minutes. What did she do on the plane? Uh, who knows? What did she do on the plane? Uh, who knows? Rodaina, Rodaina Haysam, Rodaina Haysam, Rodaina, Rodaina Haysam, are you with me? Hmm. Karma? Yes. Yalla ya Rodaina. Does she, uh, what did she do on the plane ya Rodaina? Hey. Quickly, you know your Rodaina? Did you read the email? Let's read it together. The flight attendant means the, the lady, the, there is a woman and she helps you on the plane. We called her flight attendant. Again, a woman, a pretty woman, a pretty woman. Help helps you on the plane. We call her flight attendant. The flight attendant brought us tasty snacks and there were even little screen so we could watch films. So she ate some tasty snacks and watched films. Okay. Does okay. she want to fly again? Does she want to fly again? Uh, who can answer? You, do you know the answer? Huh? Do you know? Huh? It. Huh? Who knows? Who knew it? Fairuz. Yes, she. she was. Yes, yes, she does. I want all of you to look at uh, this.
Okay, can you see the screen? Can you see this? Can you see uh, the screen? 2E? Huh? All of you? Yeah. Okay, now I want all of you to uh, read carefully, okay? Let's read carefully. Look at these pictures carefully. Here we have take off. Uh, take off means when the plane is going up high. Do you know in the email we said that uh, the plane takes off. This is the meaning of takes off. And here we said that uh, the girl sat on a window seat. Window seat means uh, when you sit beside the window. Window seat. Flight attendant. She is a flight attendant. You know, do you remember when we say that there is a flight attendant and she helps you on the plane? So this, this is flight attendant. And here I want all of you to look carefully at these linking words. We have so and because. I saw, I write so when I, it's the reason for uh, when I say, I was tired, so I went to bed. So first I was tired, then I went to the bed. So I used so in the middle. When I when I will tell you the reason why did why did I go to the bed because I was tired. So it's the reason for going to bed, and because I went to bed because I was tired. So I went to bed. And this is why, why did, I you go, where, why did I go to the bed? Because I was tired. So I went to bed, happened after feeling tired. It's the result of feeling tired. So you must differentiate between so and because, okay? And here we have and, I like apples and bananas. I like apples and bananas. And here, or do you want an apple or banana? When, uh, when I ask you to choose for only one of them. And here, I like apples, but I don't like bananas. And here, let's answer. I have got a brother and sister. So which one will I answer? Huh? Which one? Will